Yeah, that right in front of me it is Huggy Wuggy. And today, we're gonna see if we can kill him throughout the ages of time. And, um, we, we should, we should probably... Ah! Uh-oh, I'm being murdered by Huggy Wuggy. Okay, this is not... Uh, okay, I, need, I just got kicked in the face. Ow. Now, as you can probably imagine, Huggy Wuggy has an absolute ton of health. So we're going to have to try and build our armies to defeat him. So first of all, we're going to build a line of protectors at the front here. Behind them, some spear throwers. And then on the sides, we're going to have a bone mage. And at the back, a mammoth. I mean, there's no way Huggy Wuggy should be able to survive this. Also, I'm going to try and keep the money spent not much higher than Huggy Wuggy. Because Huggy Wuggy costs 4,280. So we're, actually, we're a bit too high. Let's get rid of a couple of these. There we go. All right. Let the battle begin. All right. So Huggy Wuggy has a few inches. Oh, my. Okay. Maybe Huggy Wuggy is not even going to survive the first round. So one of the abilities. <laughs> one of the abilities Huggy Wuggy has is to uh, like mind control a bit. Which is what these blue skull things are. So that's obviously not going to help. All right. So most of the normal attackers are gone now. Oh, everyone's defeated. All right. I really didn't think Huggy Wuggy would survive that. All right. Next up, we're in farmer territory. So to start off with, we're going to have a line of farmers at the front. Basically, they're just going to sponge the Huggy Wuggy attacks. And then we're going to have some potion sellers, two harvesters, and a wheelbarrow. We're, now, we spent a lot more than we should have in that. And I wish I'd got a scare. Maybe we can remove some of... Yeah, we're not going to be able to get a scarecrow. All right. That's fine. This is our army. Let's see what happens. The battle has begun. So, the potions are interesting. They should... They've literally done nothing. The potions have done nothing. And everyone is getting absolutely wrecked. Yeah, it seems like any sort of melee is just not going to work. Okay, the, uh, the wagon seems to be doing something. Okay, this doesn't seem to be going too badly. Will the farmers be able to defeat Huggy Wuggy? Um, okay. It's looking like a no. Couple more left. I <laughs> I think Huggy Wuggy's probably got this in the bag. Two more potion sellers. Oh, okay. Need in the face. What's the last one going to get? Um, A punch. Rip. All right. Well, farmers have failed us. Next up, we have med medieval. So I'm, I'm going to say that archers are going to be the key to success here. So we're going to be quite hefty on that. And then I think what we're going to do, we're going to do a knight. And then some healers. I think that's probably all right. We'll get rid of maybe... There we go. That's perfect. So hopefully uh, the the king will keep him busy. The healers will keep him alive. And then the archers will do most of the work. This is, I think, our best chance at actually beating Huggy Wuggy so far. So let's see what happens. All right. The battle has begun. And... Uh, <laughs> well, that didn't take long. Archers, fire! Are you kidding me? Why have they only just started firing? Okay. Okay. The... Oh, no. <laughs> I really thought this was going to work. Okay. Come on. I, I honestly still think that ranged attacks are going to be what does it. Because in close quarters, Huggy Wuggy is just absolutely tearing everything up. Got three... Yeah. This is done. This is done. Medieval has failed us. Medieval has failed us. Yeah. Ah. It's literally one unit. How can none of these ages of through time defeat it okay we're gonna go for something a bit stronger so we're gonna go with zeus and then two minotaurs it is way over budget a thousand over budget so if we don't see some sort of success here i'm gonna be shocked all right the battle has begun now this has been our lowest sort of amount of enemies so far and so i mean the, the minotaurs are putting up a fight is that one down what is down the zeus is still going oh oh Okay, I really wish we could have seen how much health Huggy Wuggy had there because I feel like that was doing good. Okay, it's time for the Vikings. Now, we do have Valkyries with the Vikings. So I'm going to be putting down a few of those because they can fly. Hypothetically, they're going to be staying out of the way. And then I'm also going to put some Ice Archers that may be able to freeze Huggy Wuggy. Let's see if this works out. All right, there we go. The battle has begun. The Ice Arrows are being fired. Uh, not seeing... Okay, Huggy Wuggy definitely doesn't get frozen. Oh, this is so overpowered. Okay, oh, it's kind of lifting it a bit. Because definitely having struggled getting to the Valkyrie, but it did eventually get it. And then 
I I'm just going to be honest. These guys are going to get absolutely wiped out. Actually, you know what? For fun, we're going to take control. Oh, we can see the health at the bottom. So Huggy Wuggy actually got down to half health in this fight, which is actually super interesting. But uh, yeah, we know that who's going to win this. So get out of here. Okay, last one left. I'm sorry, buddy. This has to be done. There we go. All right, we've got a slight change of scenery. So it's now green. <laughs> That's it, really. We're moving on to the dynasty. Uh, so we've got, okay, I think the Hawacha is going to be quite interesting here. And then I don't think the Monkey King is going to do much for us. I mean, we can put two Monkey Kings down. I might give this another attempt with some ninjas, but we will see. Okay, so Hawacha, get a good fire out. Okay, that should have done good. That should do a lot of damage. Monkey Kings, come on. Come on, you can do it. Oh, they did it! Huggy Wuggy's first defeat! That means that Dynasty has officially defeated Huggy Wuggy. So I think we now know that Artillery seems to be the key here. Don't worry, we're gonna give all the rest of the ages a chance to defeat them. We do have the tank, but I, I genuinely don't think the tank is gonna be able to do this on their own. The tank is better for like large groups. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a bunch of musketeers. And that is way over budget. Okay, I'm going to take that as our budget. Now, let's see these musketeers. Okay, so the great thing about musketeers is they have some pretty good stopping power. But I don't think they're going to keep Huggy Wuggy away. Are they even going to get a second shot? Oh, this is embarrassing. When, how long does it take to fire? Okay, fire! Yeah, uh, how much health has it got? Okay, Huggy Wuggy. Oh, whoops, we accidentally reset it. Yes, yeah, so these musketeers managed to put Huggy Wuggy down to nearly completely dead. But I, I, I think he's got like a slither of health left. So if they manage to get off a few more shots like now, they could... They did win! They managed to do it! Huggy Wuggy's been defeated. The closer we get to modern day, the better it seems to get. All right, let's see if we can keep up this win streak with the pirates. Now, like we said, artillery seems to work well, so we do have a cannon. But anything melee just doesn't work. Blunderbuss. I mean, should we just do the rest with blunderbusses? All right, there we go. So we've got our cannon. Oh, a beautiful first hit on Huggy Wuggy. Come on, guys. You could... Wait, I forgot what these guys... I don't these, like, fly away. Oh. 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 Okay. I don't know how much health Huggy Wuggy's on. And we've still got the cannon alive. Huggy Wuggy seems to be running away. This could be it. Another win for history. Oh, if that cannon gets another hit, I think it's done. Okay, I think that's it. I think Huggy Wuggy's got this. The blunderbusses just are... Oh, no. <gasps> yes, they won! Yeah! Let's go! All right. Now we're on to Wild West. Now, I... I think the best thing to... Oh, wait. These things are expensive. We could go with some dead eyes. So what if we just spread out some dead eyes, like, in random locations? Okay, that's about right. I was going to go with a different tactic, but this could work. So we're just literally relying on them just getting, like, crazy lo long shots. And honestly, I think they can do this. I don't know how much... Okay, that's one down. Huggy Wuggy. I just reset it again. Why do I always do that? All right, that's one taken down. So Huggy Wuggy definitely has a sort of low health. Um, but that's two down. Will they be able to... F They've done it. They've only gone and done it. All right, well, there we go. That is all of our time frames. I think what we've learned is you just got to shoot Huggy Wuggy. <laughs> so, um, yeah, what we're going to do to finish this battle is we're going to do a 100,000... That's the wrong thing. A 100,000. So that means we're going to place these Huggy Wuggies until we've got 100,000 spent. Okay, this is like actually terrifying. This is might break my computer, this battle. There we go. 100,000 has been spent. Now, what do we do against 100,000 worth of Huggy Wuggies? Well, we take what worked. Um, so we're going to go with a front line of Hawatches. These things aren't even that expensive. That should do pretty good amount of damage to start. Then we're going to have our secondary line of monkey kings. And then who else was successful? Our musketeers. We're going to have a musketeer line at the back. That could get a bit better. That is actually, that's going to, they're going to shoot each other. Okay, we need a rather thick line of musketeers here. Okay, we're only nearly even like halfway-ish. Oh yeah, cannons. Cannons. Aren't they going to shoot at the Hoatches? Okay, if we put cannons here... Oh my god. There's no way the Huggy Wuggies can survive this. All right, we're going to add some dead eyes along the sides and around the back here. And then, honestly, I think we're done. The ultimate battle of lag. Whoa! Will the Huggy Wuggies survive this? Okay, they look like they're kind of getting wrecked at the moment. And some of them have even died already. 
hundred thousands worth of Huggy Wuggies. Wh what will they do? Oh my god, they're getting wrecked. I actually thought they'd have a better chance than this, but it's awful. All right, that's there's literally one. Oh, they got hit by five cannonballs. Okay, all right, let's see if we can crash the game, eh? All right, uh, we're going a bit crazy now. All right, we've just added a bunch more Huggy Wuggies. I'm gonna stay at a distance. This is the last fight we're doing. There's there's no way that the humans can survive this, right? I mean, that's so many Huggy Wuggies. Okay, yeah, they've broken through the lines now. I think that was the key thing. It was keeping the Huggy Wuggies at a distance. As soon as that's not an option, it's kind of game over. And yeah, I, I can I can definitely say it's game over. I'm not surprised though, because there's literally like triple the budget for the Huggy Wuggies. But they won. Well, there we go. That was Totally Accurate Battle Simulator with Huggy Wuggy from Poppy Playtime. If you want to watch more, there are videos on the screen. And if you want to check out the merch, slow.com is where you need to go.